Hey everybody, I'm Graham Boyd, Xbox Live's AC Bongos, and it is great to be back in Cologne for what's sure to be another absolutely epic Gamescom week. Now here's what I love about Xbox One and Xbox Live. The clever folk on the Xbox engineering team are constantly working to deliver new features every single month. Now just before E3 this year, we launched our new feedback site, and since then we've had thousands of suggestions and over 400,000 votes from all over the world Thank you. Now, I'm really excited today to be joined by Ashley Spiker, one of our lead engineers on Xbox. And Ashley, you're going to take us through some of the new features we're going to be seeing over the next few months. That's right. So I want to walk you through three of the cool things that the team has been working on to make your Xbox even more amazing. So first, I want to show you how we're making Xbox more social and alive. And next, I want to show you how we're bringing TV to the European audience, which is something that we've heard a lot from our fans. And last, I want to show you how we're bringing more of your own personal media content to Xbox One. But let's get started with the new friend section. All right. So Xbox Live continues to be the best place for me to play with my friends. So we're playing our favorite games, we're playing new titles, and of course, we're racking up tons of gamer score as well. But how's the new friend section going to bring me and my friends back together again? So what we're doing at the new friends section is we're making it even easier to see what your friends on Xbox are up to. And also with the new Gamerscore leaderboard, you can see at a glance how you compare against your friends and earn Gamerscore for the last month. Nice, bit of competition, that's good. That's right, you gotta have competition. Uh, so you can see most of my friends are playing the new pre-release version of Sunset Overnight. All right, you don't need to show off. One of the benefits of being an Xbox <laughs> engineer. Uh, but let's take a closer look. So when we go in here, now we're looking at the new game profile page. Mm -hmm. And this is where you can see the community activities around the game. Things like game DVR clips, top players you might want to become friends with, uh, achievements they've earned, multiplayer matches you might want to jump into. And for the first time, you can actually see conversations between developers and the players. Great. But let's play. Let's play, yeah, why not? So here's Sunset Overdrive, can't wait to play this. Um, and the great thing is that the Xbox fans and community will be able to play this all this week at Gamescom. So that's great. And Ashley, looks like you've just got a message. Yeah, let's open it by doing a press and hold of the Xbox button. So this is really cool. So now you can read your message without having to come out of gameplay. That's right. Keeping you in the game and making multitasking even more useful has been a huge focus for us. And this is one example. Threaded messages with conversation history, including embedded links to game DVR clips, all while still playing your game. That's it. So I particularly love the threaded messages uh, in Snap. So what else is new in Snap mode? Well, a quick double tap of the Xbox button will bring up Snap Center. And you might recognize some of your favorite features from the Xbox 360 guide, but now it's so much better because it can be truly side by side with your game. Great. So you'll see friends, achievements, parties, messages, um, they're all there and it's really easy to jump back and forth without Brilliant. ever leaving your game. Really handy and just getting you to what you want to do much more quicker, yeah? That's right, that's the plan. So now I'm gonna walk you through some of what we're doing with TV on Xbox One. So as you might have seen, uh, we just announced the new Xbox One digital TV tuner for select markets in Europe last mm -hmm. week. And I want to show it to you in action for the first time today. Graham, why don't you grab the tablet? I will. Because of the way we've architected the system, you can stream TV from the console to any device you already own on your home network. That's any mobile device, whether it's iOS, Android, or Windows. Graham, press the Watch TV button on your tablet. Now, Forza Horizon 2 is still playing on the console, while at the same time, the Xbox is sending the TV signal over to your tablet. You can even change channels as much as you want in the one guide without interfering with my game. So, yeah, you want to give it a try? Mm -hmm. There we go. This is kind of the first time you've been able to do this on any console. That's ace, Ashley, and trust me, that is going to be massive in my house. So you've already shown us some really great stuff. What else have you got for us today? Well, a popular request from our fans is the ability to boot straight to TV. And soon that option is coming to Xbox owners everywhere. All right, wicked. And I also hear from the Xbox community all the time that they want to stream their own media to Xbox One. You know, can you enlighten them there? Yeah, we have heard that feedback too. And I have good news. Great. Um, because within the next couple of months, we are adding support for watching videos, listening to music, and browsing photos from USB and DLNA. 
And we're also going to be supporting way more formats than we did on Xbox 360, including things like MPEG-2 TS, MKV, and animated GIFs. That's awesome news, Ashley. Lots of happy people on the internet right there. So let's sum this up, okay? We're getting a more social Xbox. We're getting a new Snap Center. We're getting more live TV options, particularly for Europe. Uh, and we're getting streaming options, including USB and DLNA. When's all this coming? Everything we've talked about today is coming to you within the next few months. Brilliant. Ashley, thank you very much to you and to all the engineering teams. Great to see all these new demos, and I hope you have a great Gamescom. Thanks, Graham. And everybody else, make sure you stick with us all week for more exclusive Gamescom content on Xbox.com, your Xbox console, and twitch.tv forward slash Xbox. Do not miss a minute.